So what if we remove the air from something a whole lot bigger than an egg or a marshmallow? Like a 150 gallon drum. So what we have here is a gigantic barrel. Right now it's filled with water that we've been boiling for quite a while. And so as the water's boiling, it's evaporating and it's pushing the air out of the barrel. And so now it's just really filled with mostly steam. So Nick is going to cap the barrel at the end and lock all the steam inside. Then we're gonna cool it down and we're gonna see what happens to the barrel and the water inside. Anybody have any predictions as to what might happen? Something's gonna explode. Something's going yeah. to explode. Definitely gonna explode. Okay. That's a fair guess, given uh, what we usually do. Well, Nick, are we ready to find out? Ready to go, Kevin. That was dramatic. <laughs> All right, let's go. All right, you're not gonna roll it. All right, we're gonna start cooling this down. So now, all that water vapor inside is condensing as it's cooling back into liquid. And it's still capped, so there's no way for air to get back in there. And hopefully, the barrel will cooperate. And if it doesn't, Nick, <laughs> it's your fault. So some of the water that was resting on top of the barrel kind of just sat there as the implosion happened and it went back down, while other parts of the barrel shot water back up into the air. So you could see patterns outlining how the barrel imploded by the water and the ice that was thrown out. It was an impressive amount of power. I guess it's not my fault. It's not your fault. You did a good job. Good <laughs> Thank job. Thank you. Good job. So every square inch, like the tip of your thumb, of your body right now has about 14.7 pounds of atmospheric pressure. But when there's no air inside of the barrel here, that atmospheric pressure is enough to crush the barrel, and it did. Very surprising, because it happened all of a sudden. It was like, pa! <laughs> I did not expect it to just collapse inside of itself. That is not one that crossed my mind at all. 